Military drills involving NATO alliance states and Georgia have come to an end after a two-week run. The exercises were conducted at the Vaziani military base near the Georgian capital Tbilisi. The drills saw Georgian servicemen train along with up to 220 U.S. Marines and platoon-sized units from Bulgaria, Latvia, Lithuania and Romania. The training comes amid increased tensions in the region as a result of Russia's seizure of Ukraine's Crimean Peninsula last year and its ongoing support for insurgents in eastern Ukraine. Georgia fought a war of its own with Russia in 2008, which resulted in Moscow cementing its support for two Georgian breakaway regions, Abkhazia and South Ossetia. The exercises were held within the framework of a substantial package of support granted to Georgia by NATO leaders at a summit in Wales last year. I think what's important to understand is this is the first major exercise in Georgia that's uh, associated with the substantial package which was granted to Georgia during the Wales summit. So this is the first one connected with NATO where you have uh, NATO partners involved as observers in Georgia is open to open to NATO partners and then the joint training and evaluation center which will officially open in August will plan future exercises of this nature in Georgia. So we can expect a regular series of exercises to be conducted in Georgia. According to NATO, the military drills are aimed at supporting Georgia's advance toward membership in the alliance.